Hello everybody and welcome to Dan Mackey Season 2 Episode, um, we're on 7 or 8? 7, we're on 7 because it was an episode, 7, episode 7 anime review. This episode, man this was the, the, the beginning, the prelude, prelude to, prelude to war, let's go with prelude to war, that's a good, a good thing of saying. A lot of stuff happened, a lot of it was like, Bell, stop it, you're a bad boy, stop Bell. You're in trouble. You're in trouble with everyone. There was a lot of that. But anyway, let's crack on with this. Start at the beginning, as always, and see what happened properly. So Belle made it back to the mansion, and Hestia, she's not, she's not very pleased with him for staying in the pleasure quarter overnight. She found the aphrodisiac, and because he promised not to tell on Hermes that he was there, He's like, uh, I, I can't, I can't say nothing. I'm sorry. I, I, I can't. I gotta keep it a secret. But uh, they, she forgives him because he's like, yeah, you know, you can't lie. That's you're off the hook. But now you have to go sweep the neighborhood. Damn it, Bell. And uh, he sees some kids while he's doing that, and they remind him of Haruhime. So he's like, oh man, what do I do? He says that a lot. He's like, what do I do? What, what's the objective I should be doing? Uh. The rest of the familia then also help him sweep sweep and stuff. And that's when he finds out Mikoto was looking for Haruhime. Uh, and then Lily and Wealth are basically like, No. Bell? Bell. Stop it. Don't do it. You're going to cause us all trouble. Behave. Off to Hermes now and he tells... Well, he's with the, 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 the restaurant, the bar, whatever. He tells Mamma Mia, he's like, Mamma Mia... I need to get a message to Freya because Ishtar's after Belle and I need to let her know what's going on. Uh, while he says that, Seer hears. Right. Seer, right? I, she's so suspicious. I, I can't be the only one that thinks she's really suspicious. I might have mentioned it already, but there's something. There's something. I've got a feeling, but I, I have no idea. It's, that's, the, that's the point about it. Like, I've got feelings. But I don't know. And I don't want to say, just in case I'm right and then people accuse me of throwing spoilers. I'm not going to do that. But anyway. Uh, I've lost my notes. Belle goes to Aina and tells her what happened about how he was in the pleasure quarter. And she's like, Belle, no. You're not allowed to pleasure quarter. But uh, then he gets some information about the Ishtar familia in the book. I guess. That's, that's just what it is. It's just the book. Uh, and then... She tells him about rumours of Ishtar Familia cheating their levels or something. So, like, they're higher level than what they're reporting. Uh, and then the Ishtar Familia made the guild pay them. Because they was like, their, all the public information got leaked or something. Or leaked to the public. So, they made the guild pay them. Uh, and then they can't intervene in the Pleasure Quarter. Because the guild is already in the bad books uh, with Ishtar Familia. So... That's why the guild... That's basically the reason why the guild lets him get away with it, I guess. Then Belle goes to a bookstore and finds a book about a hero who killed a prostitute to get his honour back. And Belle's like, man, that's not good. That's, that's a terrible book. He throws it behind him and then dabs. He doesn't really, though. Uh, Aisha gives Haruhime a present and then Mikoto shows up and is like, Haruhime, hello, it's me. And then she acts like she doesn't know who she is. She's like, I don't know you. Exactly like that. That's exactly what happened. And uh, yeah, poor, poor Makoto. She's, she's going to do something incredibly stupid, probably. Makoto speaks to Belle about, hey, I went to go see her, but she didn't pretend. Eh, she tells him what happened, basically. And then she tells him about her past with Haruhime, about how they met and snuck her out of the mansion and all that. Good stuff. And then Belle's like, okay, we'll go save her. We can do that. Let's just do it. Let's, we won't tell the others. We got this. Uh... Hermes is eavesdropping very badly, and then he tells them, he's like, because she's a prostitute, you can buy her with the money. Uh, and it's like, what, two or three million? And I, I went, ah, like that. But they were like, you know what, we can afford that. That's reasonable. And I was like, is it? The word million implies that's a lot. I don't know. I don't know. But uh, yeah, then after hearing her name and race, he, he tells them that he delivered the killing stone to Ishtar. Again, that he, I don't remember. I don't remember that. I'm glad I remember parts from the light novel, but I've forgotten a lot. Like, so it's still like I sort of know what's going on, but I've forgotten a lot. That's I'm glad I've got that kind of mix. I think. I think that's definitely good for me. It's better than if I just remembered everything. 
Ishtar orders everybody in her familia to kidnap Belle, basically, just to get at Freya. Just because she's like, oh, if I get him, <laughs> that'll show her. <laughs> that's, that's, that's my Ishtar voice, terrible. But she tells the, all the Amazons, hey, don't bang him, I'll do it first, then it's up to you. Uh, and then something about doing a killing stone ritual, and then they're going to go to war with Freya. Uh, there's a lot of information at once, uh, as you can tell. Uh, and then we go to the dungeon with the crew. The uh, the crew being Hestia Familia, the four of them. They're just hunting for money. They filled Wealth and Lillian and what they're doing. They're like, hey, we're just going to buy her. And they're like, oh. like I'm disappointed, but that's that's, that's a better plan than just going in guns blazing so you know I can support that Ishtar Familia are waiting in the dungeon I wonder why Aisha gets a power up by a mysterious hooded figure who could it be I have no idea I I, I, I know but like come on uh, then Bell gets Bell gets separated while they're fighting monsters and Aisha grabs him and then starts attacking him and then the episode ends with her uh, slicing down so he's definitely dead um, there's no there's no way he survived that you know despite the fact that they've got to take him in alive. He's dead, okay? The series is over. This is actually the final episode. It's not really. Um, but yeah, that was the end of this week's episode. Like I said, prelude to war. I think starting... I really... I can't remember how long... This is a longer light novel, and I really can't remember. I can't figure out if the way this is going to be the rest of the season, or if, you know, we're going to have volume 8 as well because I can't remember how long this arc is uh, at all okay well I think I'll just end it here because I can't have anything else to say thank you for everybody for watching if you enjoyed this video consider subscribing to watch more of these videos uh, I will see you next week and bye guys <laughs>